subscribe to the channel for more tales like these. AITA for blocking my twin because she tried to sleep with my fiancé? For context, my twin and I are identical twins, but different heights due to childhood illness. I am shorter and more petite due to the illness, but a healthy 28, F, adult. My fiancé, 29M, is now my husband. Backstory My twin and I already had a complicated relationship due to her not respecting boundaries, expecting me to be available whenever she wanted and having hissy fits any time I spent time with my own friends. But then cancelling our plans an hour after we were supposed to meet to spend time with her friends. This was a continual ongoing issue throughout our whole lives. I should be available to her 110% of the time, hate any friends I made, hate any guy I dated, I should only want to be with her. Hugh and my husband. My husband is an amazing, patient, handsome, fun-loving man. I could not ask for a better life partner. When we started dating, my twin reacted to him like all of my exes, interrogated him, assumed he was going to be abusive for, X number of reasons, hostile, etc., to clarify my husband is not abusive. My husband knowing that being close to my family is really important to me, did his best efforts to get my twin's approval. He jumped through all of the hoops and trials, and even made friends, or so we thought, with my twin. He is now also really close with my parents and grandparents, and sees them regularly even if I am at work. My twin is also married, was engaged at the time, so we thought nothing of her now being friendly with my husband. One evening while my husband and my twin were hanging out, roommates at the time, slash separate bedrooms, they had a good chat about life. When they went to hug goodnight, my twin pressed her boobs on my husband, said I appreciate what we have, whatever this is, and tried to kiss him. My husband rejected her advances, and then called me immediately afterwards, I was at work. I tried asking my twin what happened for context, and she just gaslit me about it. Days and weeks following that night she started telling everyone that my husband is a pervert and pedophile, because he married me, who looks like a child, even though I am 28. And has created more rumors since, we don't live together anymore. She also had a meltdown right before my wedding and has been super petty since. I have now blocked her because she refuses to apologize for trying to sleep with my husband and spreading rumors. Ida? Updates, the people asking about her husband's thoughts on it. My twin essentially has told her husband, nothing happened that she did not hit on my husband, that my husband is lying, etc. Her husband believes her and is also pushing the rumors that my husband is a pedo, etc. Her husband spent so much time trying to shit talk my husband at the family get-together that different individuals asked them to stop talking about my husband and I because they were getting so annoyed. It's also how my husband and I found out about the rumors. None of my other siblings believe or agree with the rumors that my twin and husband have spewed. Honestly, the only people still defending my twin and her husband's actions are my parents. Other update, I have definitely cut my twin and her husband out of my life, this is more of event post. For those asking about setting boundaries prior to this block. I had already had many arguments with my twin about her behavior and how I was done with it. She continually stepped over those boundaries. The final straw was her trying to sleep with my husband. I had asked her multiple times over the phone, with already limited contact, to apologize to him. During the family get-together it was a final Hail Mary to get her to admit to her shit and apologize, which she did not. Lead to an official absolute block. Only to find out about the rumors afterwards. Despite this, my parents want to try and mend things with my twin. Which is an absolute no, on mine and my husband's end. Top comments. First. OP is an asshole, for allowing her sister to treat her husband this way. As soon as she started calling him abusive, OP should have put proper boundaries in place. Husband as fortunate sister didn't try and falsely accuse him of something. I would be furious with my partner if they put me in this situation with their family. Edited, the update where your brother-in-law is spreading rumors your husband is a pedo? I'm sorry, but it might be time for your husband to leave you. That is a very, very serious and heinous allegation. You need to do everything in your power to put a stop to that. There is no saving this marriage unless you cut your immediate family, parents, twin etc., out of your life, to protect your husband. Are you willing to do that? Second. Twin sis and her husband might need to be reminded of the definitions of slander and false accusations. A cease and desist letter from a lawyer might serve as a solid reminder. Cut comms with your sis and her husband. If anyone else believes her, do the same. You seem unable to put your foot solidly down where your twin is concerned. Your husband sounds like a gem. Protect him. Protect each other. Third. NTA, I hope her remarks about your spouse haven't upset him. To be honest, I wouldn't talk to her again out of respect for him. It's particularly strange because, according to her husband, identical twins that I have known have generally desired to be treated as unique individuals rather than as deeply ingrained or as people who are out to take each other's lives. Fourth. 
NTA, I hope her remarks about your spouse haven't upset him. To be honest, I wouldn't talk to her again out of respect for him. It's particularly strange because, according to her husband, identical twins that I have known have generally desired to be treated as unique individuals rather than as deeply ingrained or as people who are out to take each other's lives. Fifth. Since the beginning, your sister has been poisonous, and you have tolerated it. Eliminate her permanently. No thanks for accepting. Too much harm has been done. In my opinion, I would quickly file for divorce from you if you were my partner and you had forgiven your sister after she had sexually assaulted me and spread false information. Inform your family that you won't be at the get-togethers she attends. Sixth. Just remind your parents that she called your husband a pedophile for liking you. Just hammer that home every time they try to bring her up. Make sure to emphasize how much that claim could have hurt him in the wrong years. If you want to go the extra mile, dig up so real horror stories of what could have happened with that kind of accusation getting tossed around. At least, that's what I would do. I can be kinda petty, though. Either way, you need to hammer .it into their heads that at this point, they can either have two daughters separately or just one daughter. Subscribe.